William Henry Harrison was born on February 9, 1773, at Berkeley Plantation in Charles City County, Virginia. He came from a distinguished political family, his father signed the Declaration of Independence. Harrison entered the military at an early age, serving as an ensign in the army at the age of 18. He rose through the ranks and played a significant role in defeating Native American forces at the Battle of Fallen Timbers in 1794, securing the Northwest Territory for American settlers. Appointed as the first governor of the newly formed Indiana Territory in 1801, worked to establish law and order in the frontier region and negotiated numerous treaties with Native American tribes. One of Harrison's most notable achievements was the Battle of Tippecanoe in 1811. Fought against Native American forces led by Tecumseh, a Shawnee leader, and his brother, Tenskwatawa, the prophet. The victory at Tippecanoe elevated Harrison's political profile and earned him the nickname Old Tippecanoe. The battle had political consequences and played a role in the tensions leading up to the War of 1812. Harrison served in the War of 1812, playing a notable role in the defense of the Northwest Territory against British and Native American forces. Harrison achieved a significant victory at the Battle of the Thames in 1813, where Tecumseh was killed. After the war, Harrison served in the U.S. House of Representatives from 1816 to 1819. He also held diplomatic roles, including serving as the U.S. Minister to Columbia. Harrison ran for the presidency in 1840 as the Whig Party candidate. His campaign emphasized his military achievements and portrayed him as a man of the people. Harrison won the election, becoming the ninth president of the United States. Unfortunately, his presidency lasted only 32 days, as he succumbed to pneumonia on April 4, 1841. Harrison's death led to discussions about the line of presidential succession, as the Constitution wasn't explicit about the procedures for replacing a deceased president. His grandson, Benjamin Harrison, later became the 23rd President of the United States. In summary, William Henry Harrison's legacy is marked by his military successes, particularly in the Northwest Territory, and his short-lived presidency, which had implications for the understanding of presidential succession. His contributions to the early growth of the United States, both militarily and politically, remain noteworthy in American history.